Well, we've got another sunless, overcast, breezy day. Don't have a lot of time. Incoming tide like usual. So we've got another week cycle of this afternoon incoming. So that's gonna put a damper on the outside. But uh, figure I'd just come back in, do a little bit of tarpon scouting, quick and easy. Uh, pinfish were like brutally hard to find. Luckily I was able to get grunts at my other spot. So uh, we made it out in time for about an hour before magic hour. So we're gonna see if we can pull something out here really quick. We are on. That just basically hit the water. Alrighty. That worked out well. See if we cannot mess this one up. All right. Oh. I'm gonna get up on him real quick. Shaking his head. Oh. Man, he took off a long ways. Oh, 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 did it come off or did he change lanes? Oh, he changed lanes. All right. <laughs> well, there are still tarping around. Oh, there he is. Gulping for air. That's what happens when you get those. You do a hundred yard dash, get tired. It's good. Oh! Lost him again. Way up there, what happened? Did it pull or break? feel like it broke something cut my braid oh leave mackerels that sucked grab my bobber at least man too much line out there might be a uh, submerged buoy out here. I think got something on this one. Oh, it feels like a Cuda shark. Cuda shark. Non tarpon. Could be a very, very small tarpon. Maybe a jack. I'm thinking Cuda. Jack. Cuda? Shark? I haven't had a shark in a long time.
I'm leaning towards shark now. Oh, man. Oh. 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 Man, good size jack. Keeps getting bigger and bigger. <laughs> well, after this, I'm just gonna have one grunt left for magic hour. That's bad bait management. Although I did have that tarpon, so it worked out. This dude. Man. Wow, look at that dude. That's a chunker. Ugh. Nice chunker. Damn, where did you come from? What are you doing in here? I'll get you back in the water here. Because, yeah, let's take a measurement on this dude. Got my measuring stick. Right out there. Yeah, 32 inches, give or take. There. there yeah right around 32 inches not bad oh, 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 no. wait just take a photo just take a photo be kind to me had a rough day Well, we're just coming almost right up to magic hour. And this is my last grunt. Poor bait management. I couldn't catch any pinfish today. I just, none. Then I went uh, to my uh, grunt spot. Luckily I got a half dozen of those. I did get uh, one pinfish in that batch there from there. And uh, that's what I got the tarpon on. These guys have been getting chomped up by uh, toothy critters. This is my last one, so I'm gonna put this one on my uh, conventional setup, put that out there with the clicker, switch over my spinning rod to the uh, pink hoagie, and I'll just start fan casting that out while this is out on the bobber and see if we could pull something out in this magic hour and hopefully not a cuda, shark, or big jack. <laughs> All right, so we're right in the magic hour now, sunset. Incoming tide is definitely pushing it, so the live bait is not going to be so great unless I move out a bit. But for casting wise, this is perfect. I'm right along the edge, so I'm going downwind so I can get some distance. And I'm just going to be flicking this thing around and see if I could draw a strike. Get it out there and work it in and see if we can get an artificial bite. And that one I'll just keep casting it out, letting it drift, casting it out, letting it drift, and hopefully we'll get one more shot. Well, something whack this, that could be the end of my last bait there. Unless it's on there. Ah, I might still have the bait. Something definitely whacked it though. Might have been a dang cooters. Still alive, buddy? Alive and kicking. Looks like he got might have got a little squished, but alright, put him back out again and see if we can get lucky. And for the last bit of uh, magic hour, I'm gonna troll the uh, nine-inch paddle tail. I got whacked uh, the other day 
only issue is that there has not been any mullet around so uh i think they're still looking for it real late at night but i haven't found a mullet school in a week which might be a good thing for me to do tomorrow is do a bait run and see what's around but we're just gonna troll this guy around and uh see if we can get a last minute hail mary tarpon